Hey everyone, Mike Moo here. It's been a minute. I know, I've been really busy. Anyway, today I got my Peak Design Kickstarter kit, which includes a bunch of stuff, including an iPhone 12 Pro Max case, the Creator Kit, the wall mount, another wall mount, and then finally the out front bike mount. Now this isn't everything that I actually backed because at the time the iPhone 12 Pro Max was out and they didn't have the 13 Pro Max yet. Back this a long time ago. Of course, now that I have 13 Pro Max, I have to wait a couple of months. Or do I? It's a hack job, right? The key to making my thing work well is you could either do a lot of patience or you could use a really sharp razor blade and spend a lot of time. Or you can even use a file if you want. Uh, the key part is is that this section right over here of the 13 Pro Max is actually a little bit bigger, of course, because you got the bigger cameras. That's a lot of what you're paying for in the new iPhone 13 Pro Max. And so what will happen is you will need to carve out a bigger piece out of this whole set. Now, I want you to pay attention very closely to this because this might not have got caught on the GoPro. Now, there's actually a section over here that is all plastic all the way around this. Now what I did was, uh, because I had the tools, is I took my router and I did a straight router bit, the smallest one that I had in my cheap little kit, and basically cut all the way around here right up to the section. I just removed all the plastic around this fabric here, and I just cut it all the way out, all the way around. And I took off a millimeter all the way around here and I left a little bit of a camera bump right over here, just a little bit over there. Now I might have taken off a little bit more than I needed to, but I just wanted to ensure that it would uh, actually fit. So I carefully did as carefully as I could without using my router table, just routed all the way around here. I had my router clamped down anyway. So in the end result is that it actually fits. Now, now I could go ahead and take a little bit of sandpaper and sand it down so that it's a nicer smooth finish. Now the negative side of this is that it is a little bit sharp over here. Just a little bit because of how, how deep I had to cut it there. But if you look at it from a little bit further away, it's not too bad. I just have to sand it down just a little bit. But the most important part is that I get to use this and protect my 13 Pro Max. I get to take advantage of their maglock, I think that's what it's called, and take advantage of my creator kits with my new 13 Pro Max versus waiting, I don't know when, a month, two months, next year, before I get my 13 Pro Max version of the case. And of course, because I cut it out like this, it is still compatible with my 12 Pro Max if I need to. And uh, once my 13 Pro Max unit comes in or a case comes in, I can go ahead and slot this in uh, right on the 13 Pro Max and relegate this to the 12 Pro Max. All right, hope this video was helpful to you. Please give a like, subscribe for more, and I'll catch you next one. Thanks for watching.